Good morning. Morning, everybody. Good morning, Ram. Morning, Jaro. Hey, here's three. Thank you for the 34 months. I appreciate you. I hope you get. Hey, Mittens. Hey, Vanessa. Hey, Deacon. And Bind. Kai, good to see you. Who else is in here? Ricky, I saw you in here, idiot. Hey, Wolfie. I'll finish a cup of coffee. I'm a bit late starting because I had to uh, try my suit on and stuff this morning. Make sure everything was good. Which it is. Right, timer. Let me get that sorted out. Timer, timer, timer. Boop. Is that working? Sure is. It sure is. Okay, Siri's an idiot, huh? Do, do, do. Give me one second. Do you have a full list? No, I haven't had the time this morning to sort out the the fancy thing I normally do. I just have a I have a written down list that I'll just I think it's a good too because I'm not I don't want to put them all in and be like, hey, do this with this person, and then that person's not around. So right now it's just exclamation mark sub goal. Uh oh. I timed out from the queue. Rip. Listen, I know it's blasphemous, but I gotta take my socks off. I can't stream with socks on. It's true. It's blasphemous, I know. Uh but I will say, if you still got if you guys still have this what is the thing. Is that you slut, huh? <laughs> Bridge, I think for the 14 months, buddy. I appreciate you, man. Welcome back, Brett. Let's see what dark white is true. I, I get worried every time I come around now. Also, the plan for this stream, the overall, the arc of today uh, is, uh, well, we're going to be writing the warrant for the senator. And we're probably going to be talking to the senator, well. too. I can't believe I just said that with my mouth. So, yeah, that's the <laughs> plan. I think it's a great way to, you know... It'll be a great way to send off as my last stream. Because I don't think I'm going to be streaming on Sunday, by the way. You know, not that I'm stressed, but I'm stressed. So I want to make sure I've got Sunday to sort everything out before wedding and... The honeymoon things. Huh? Mary, thank you for the 25 months. And Fitz, thank you for the three months too, buddy. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. On the plus side, I tried my suit on and everything this morning. And it's good. Ah. And Fitz. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah. Arctic, thank you for the 12 months. I, I, said that I appreciate you. Mouth. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, thank you, guys. Always tomorrow. What are the plans for the rest of the summer then? I don't think we're going to be able to do that until, you know, I don't think John, I haven't even emailed John or the senator yet to see if he's even available. So it might not even happen. It might not even happen. The contingency for when dark gets domed, we got we got finished bold as a gate. <laughs> That's a contingency. <laughs> Thank you, Mittens. I appreciate it. Oh right, let's go. Oh yeah, the mission row got fucking blown up again. By an EMS! What is that? Oh, what is that shit? Yeah, I found out reading things this morning. Um, his his sweets. Hey, command, it's me, sweets. 
Remember when I said we disarmed a bomb at Trooper PD? Well, an EMS snuck a bomb into the cells of Mission Row PD and it was not disarmed. <laughs> the explosion sh shook MRPD and will be going through repairs for the next three days. The main repair focus would be the motor pool and working upwards. <sighs> that happened somebody to leave you know it's called justice oh there's people in here what the hell I think it's more so just uh, all these issues are just like a general consensus of shift three and not like departmental He's dropping. specific. Um, He's dropping. Departmental? Um, I don't think, I think we're honestly in a pretty solid spot. Uh, all the officers, gone. I don't really have an issue with what they do, uh, okay. Okay, but it's more good. like the so general shunt. People are stepping up in terms of uh, lead. How, what is the best way of addressing that? Is it the T? Because the way that I do that is there's certain oh. officers who are like, eh, I feel like I'm not stepping up more, and I'm like, I bet. Wait, I got an idea. Officers like that that aren't willing to step up. This doesn't be funny. Uh, <clears throat> take this as you will. Uh, that's just my advice. Uh, the, to me, the best way to swim. Uh, grab him by the fucking neck and throw him in the deep end. Also, did you hear someone... I got a good song. I heard footsteps, but I don't see anyone. Oh, oh, Dark's a... Oh, my God. Richard Dark? Richard Dark. Oh, you're fuck, around... it's my boss. <laughs> oh, you're your boss. You're your sweet boss. Oh, God, oh, it's fuck, scary. Fuck, it's my boss. Act cool. Act professional. We're Quick, totally act, like, act like we know... Act like oh, we know oh. what we're doing. Oh! Hey! Oh, you hey, hey Dark! What's going on in here? Why are you naked? What? I live upstairs. Uh, oh. We're we're I'm just doing like you know our cross shifts conversations, sir. Can you your sir? Can you can you res respectfully, sir? Oh my God, I'm, I'm, he's jacked. You got two eyes right now. Can you two eyes white dragon? Can you go huh? put some clothes on, sir? I already have you, one eye, sweet. Sir, can you, <laughs> respectfully, sir, something's staring at me, and it sure as shit ain't your eye. Can you <laughs> uh, go put some pants on, please, sir? Fine. Th thank you, sir. I'm glad you said it. I didn't want to be the guy. But... Well, look, I made fun of his <laughs> eye once, and he made me wear an eye patch for a week. I think he's just... Oh. Honestly, you know what? He's British. I feel like we shouldn't take what he says seriously, but I'm obviously biased as an Irishman, so. Yeah, I feel like. But obviously, as a know. more superior, you know, background, you know, obviously the fighting Irish, and then you know, a anyway. <clears throat> uh huh. Um, yeah. So in terms of, I don't know, in in shift three. Obviously, this is your fucking baby, but if people aren't stepping up, the best way. That, the way that I found. Maddie, you're pregnant? Um, <laughs> no, no, that's news to me. Congratulations. I heard baby. What? Maddie, yeah, your I'm baby. I'm birthing like 22 LSPD children. No. Yeah. 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 I sorry. Sorry to interrupt. Yeah. What? No, it's fine. No, you can. You're good. Uh, so it's you failed to defuse the bomb. What, I want, what I what I want to know is why you managed to defuse the bomb at Trooper PD, but not at Mission Row where we home where it ourselves. Counts. Yeah, oh. what's that about? You want to be a trooper, sweet? You got something to tell okay. me? Okay, Dark, you want to know something that pisses me off? Oh. I out of the six bombs I've attempted to disarm, I've disarmed four and failed two. Okay, which is a pretty good success rate, and I'm not EOD certified. Mm. 
All right, what's your what's your success right there, Big D? Hundred percent. How many bombs have you disarmed? Zero. <laughs> exactly. Well, then respect <laughs> per, uh, permission to speak freely. No. All right. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, uh, well, sir, I'm not EOD certified, and much like anybody's certification, if they are certified, they take the reins. And someone who was newly EOD certified set the bomb off. Who was it? And fuckhead McGee, number one. What? Give me a second. Call him out. LSPD. What the fuck's his name? Give me a second. It's not LSPD. It's not That's LSPD. Right. That's all I'll say. It doesn't answer my question. God damn it. Look, I have been on, I have been <laughs> dealing with a lot today. I'm trying to be more conscientious about poking into other ships and talking to other sergeants as in a lieutenant. I don't TLDR, know. Dark. Wait, can you lock the door to this place, Dark? Can I lock the door? I mean, sure. Maybe. I know what I'm doing. Yeah, you're an assistant Thank chief. Thank fuck, exactly I hope so. You're an assistant chief of police. I just want to say it's very nice being the lowest rank in the room for a change. I'm not going to lie. Uh, I like it. I can lock it. Beep boop. I think it's locked. It's locked. Okay, <clears throat> perfect. So, TLDR. I'm about to clock off duty. The, the sun is setting on my day. I'm... I achieved... Perfection. It's 30 minutes past 8 in the morning. And yep. MRPD also just blew up. So I well, we live in soon. different fucking times of the day, Big D. So. No, take your phone out, Jerry. What time is it? it time is to. 8, 8 16. <laughs> Permission to speak freely. No, no. <laughs> All right, sir. Yes, it's 8 in the morning. Well, different time of day, Los Santos time. Anyway, I was getting my car fixed. I was about to go off duty. Next thing I hear, Aaron Carter scream over the fucking radio. EMS just planted are planning a bomb inside of the cells of MRP. And, and I'm like, ain't no way. What? Obviously, this does not leave this fucking room in terms of command. Uh, so I'm like, okay, it'd be pretty awkward if I 42 now, right? That'd be... Yeah, pretty... it'd kind of be like... It's not like I can run past the bomb and go, one sec, gotta take a quick shower, right? Sorry, Help lock I'm down tired. the scene. TLDR. Member of the Bang Boys, Erwin Dundee, asked for a 52 request for taser prong removal inside of the cells of MRPD. During that time, an uh, EMS of the name of Shay Flynn uh, brings a bomb inside of MRPD. Jesus fucking Christ. Now, um, <clears throat> when it comes to items being dropped off inside of uh, MRPD basket, you know, we ask members and <clears throat> those items are removed. So they won't search, is what you're saying. That's not, they, it's not listen, I'm not blaming anybody for that, but, you know, you know I, it's not I, a normal I'm going to word this in the most uh city way i can they were searched uh -huh. but not thoroughly that Wait. is the oh. most way i'm gonna word this okay i feel like the the officer who i will name is aaron carter who there we do have a uh where the items that are removed are searched and they're placed inside of a basket but <clears throat> They were brought in, and while uh, Irwin Dundee was receiving medical, a C4 explosive was placed with, uh, I want to say, 13 to 15 minutes on the timer. Two wires were cut. Fast wire was cut. It was set off. MRPD is unstable at the moment. I will be reviewing it uh, tomorrow. I'm going to be hiring uh, some construction people, probably some HOA Considering they did some construction on the courthouse a couple of months back. Hey, Joe, what? The, the criminals? Yeah. Hey, anybody working in construction is a criminal. You see how much they get paid, Dark? 
You, yeah. you want to argue with that? You want to argue? They're with probably that? good with tools, though. Not gonna lie. Yeah, you want to argue with that, Dark? Because come on. I just don't know whether that, yeah, ah, listen, I'll no, leave that go, to go, you. Go, Dark, ask you your sweet. council how much it's going to cost you to build a fucking uh, a shed in your back fucking garden, and then we'll talk. <laughs> All right. Yeah, yeah. Not that I mean to pull the EU card on you. <laughs> hey. Yeah. You can't pull that card on me anyway. I can. I can't. No. Why can't I? Brexit. Brexit. Yeah, I still fucking can. Oh, yeah, okay, sorry, call up fucking, I don't know, whatever, I don't know how it fucking works in, I guess, Britain, the less of, anyway, we're, get, we're getting, well, we're what's getting What's happening topic. to this, this EMS? So the EMS has been, uh, was supposed to be interrogated, but. Supposed we to be. To get, we, okay, hold up, hold on. Um, wanted to get a bunch more facts, wasn't really willing to talk, sent up on a 24-hour investigative hold. Uh, Erwin Dundee, who was the one who called the 52 request, and I, I know you guys are going to be fucking blown away what I'm what I'm uh, gonna about to say, which I know you're going to say, oh my god, there ain't no way Lieutenant Jerry Elizabeth Sweets. Um, Erwin Dundee was like, you know what? Yeah, I'll go into interrogation after 30, 40 minutes. Went into interrogation, recording started, and didn't say anything. Crazy, I know. Wow, wow. What a that's holy shit. I have never been so mind blown. Spirits. The spirits. So they were sent up. Um, Gone spirits. Subpoenaed alongside Erwin Dundee. Um, spoken to a couple of MCU. Uh, <clears throat> so Erwin Dundee was placed in. Uh, vicinity with Cap Terra Nova as well as the EMS was placed with Aziz who has Bang Boys uh, connections. Oh. So there is a connection here between the Bang Boys a couple other people but nothing is entirely <laughs> clear cut. Personally, I don't know if this EMS worked off of, uh, you know, the Bang Boys have a person I care about out in a field out in the middle of nowhere with a fucking eagle pressed to their forehead and I'm operating under duress, or I've been brainwashed into uh, operating them. But I will say one thing. MCU told me something today, which I'll be sharing with you. Uh, Shay Flynn, one of the EMS, uh, somebody they care about, aka a Mayhem member, was killed by DOC during the holdout. Oh, well, there's the motivation. Well, yeah, yeah, there it is. Wait, did no one see the EMS plant the bomb at Mission Raw? Yes. So, oh. that's what, what? That's not an answer, sweet. <clears throat> I don't know how to word this without, again, this is a weird thing. I'm oh, trying to it find the right no. words. Christ, sweet. I, 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 did did somebody see them plant a bomb or no? No to permission to speak. Just give us an answer. <laughs> did the cop see them plant a bomb or not? Yes, Erin Carter witnessed them plant the bomb. What? Which is she, Wait, did she just stand there? I don't know how to this. Wait, hang on. Dark, uh, stand by me I'm sweet. planning a bomb, but don't do anything. <clears throat> Sorry. No, no. Okay, that is an unfair way to word that up. Yes, Aaron Carter witnessed the bomb being placed by EMS. But she only saw it the last second when it was planted. Mm. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Gotcha. Okay, gotcha. okay, okay. Hey, hey, hey. Okay, so <laughs> I am operating... <laughs> Man, okay, look, okay, this what? looks odd. Jesus Christ, oh, Gary! Oh look the other way. Nice Dark, look the other way. Okay, so I'm reaching for some wires to pull out of my suspect, and I'm, you know, a little hard to dif differentiate between the two. Um, uh, yeah, okay, I see why you know, Aaron only saw it last thing. Okay. Yeah, I'm just, yep. listen. If she's if if the emails was 
Because you walk in, I don't, I don't blame him. Yeah, you know, it's, you it's know, it's like body parts, taser prong, C four, you know. Easier, 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 like you know. <clears throat> easier, mistake to, I mistake easy. C four and taser prongs all the time. Exactly, exactly. Yeah. So <laughs> when, uh, the way that I'm seeing this is, I'm gonna be getting a construction crew tomorrow to clear out the motor pool to get that back up and running because that's my main concern. As, as in regard to the bombing itself and the party involved. Your mic is on its calls. Sweet. Yes. <laughs> oh, my Dark. My main, con my main concern is going to be fucking. Yes. Yes. The cells are where the main bombing was. They're blown to fucking bits. Active patrol is way more of a concern than a bunch of iron fucking bars where we have Beaver's Bush and SESO. And if, if someone's getting like, I don't want to drive up there. Well, tough shit. They shouldn't have done fucking crime. Uh, respectfully, sir. Respectfully. With all, due re <laughs> with all due respect, sir. Okay. Listen, not to make things worse or anything, but I'm probably going to be writing a warrant for the senator today. Ooh, <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> a little dark. For <laughs> what? Uh, he, he attempted to murder Kyle Pratt in prison. <laughs> Oh, okay. Yeah, so, uh... Well, that, then, that's my... That's I'm gonna my try and talk chief. to the guy first. You know, maybe get his side of things, but there's no oh, long side to it. You can't do anything. Oh, yeah, that's, um... That's probably, I might, yeah. You might want to look at LSBN if you haven't looked at to... Uh, oh, my God's at, uh, sake. What now? <laughs> What's happening now? There's already an article about the bombing. Uh, Sanguine's claiming Drop. it. They're calling it uh, Return to Sender. What but the my main fuck concern. Is this Bojack Horseman picture on the. Th what is that? Well, Bojack Horseman is about a reflection about how. Uh, I suppose. I don't know. I don't want to get into that. I watched it a couple of times. I guess it's about how, you know, you can get everything you want, but you can still be a giant piece of shit. And even as, as hard as you try deep down you know you're a piece of shit and you try to write about the uh, the people that are around you who asked but no, Jerry, no, no matter what, what, what you did, what you this? you literally <laughs> ask you asked what do you do uh respectfully uh respectfully <laughs> sir i was on about why is there a picture of a man in a horse mask on lsbn oh because they're claiming one guy's named the trojan the other guy's named fenrir which sounds like a uh a, a, a reddit fursona no, Which... how dare you? That is Norse mythology, okay? You uncultured swine. Norse mythology? Yeah. Do they also like to fuck people dressed as animals? Uh, no, they actually, I think Loki actually fucked animals or something. He low-key fucked animals? My no. Man. Okay. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Jesus. <laughs> All right. Woo! Well, there you go. That's... That's shift two. Wow. Everything that's happening. Well, sounds shift like you got things coming. Well, you sweet, it. um, you know, if anything happens to me today, um, yeah, I'd like you to be uh, the assistant chief if anything happens to me. <laughs> what? Get fucked, sweet. <laughs> what? In case, uh, listen, we've got Madison as a witness. If I, if something does happen, then you've got to step up. And, and, and Libby's gonna need ya. Step, step up! I'm already trying to step up. Well, okay, I, thank that's you, my dying it. wish now, so if you... That's your dying wish! <laughs> uh, you gotta fulfill that if Dark dies, yeah. you know what I'm just saying. Guess you're stuck. Sorry, Sweet. Smoke billowing. Rubble, 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 rubble. You have to imagine it, chat. Just imagine. Just imagine the sight. Oh my god. Not again. So emotional. Can we actually. Hold on. What's the announcement? Can we use anything? Hmm. 
Um, I don't actually. Know. I don't think anything is available. You know what? I'm just gonna grab a car and go somewhere else. And we we gotta watch these LSBN articles, man. Ugh. Oh, for fuck's sake. I need to sell that office because it's just not getting used. I kind of feel bad. Like they should have taken it off me, but I still make payments, so maybe not. Make a state announcement that creates maximum panic. What the fuck? All right, we need to go grab some food. Uh, yeah, I don't know what we're going to do with the senator thing. What I'll probably do is I'll email him in a minute. I kind of want to... Uh, basically, I posted it to Eichmann. I was like, does anyone have any objections? Uh, Tessa said no, but I haven't heard from the others yet. Uh, but I'm just doing what we talked about doing in that Heikman meeting we had at SDSO, which was basically... I think, I think what would be best is bringing him in asking him some questions regarding the incident um see if we can slip in some other questions regarding sanguine in there too maybe just so we have them on recording on you know on record that'd be juicy um if he decides to go you know what's the word what's the way of saying it oh it's fucking closed you're shitting me Well, Scorched Earth, yeah. If the Senate decides to go Scorched Earth, then we might have some answers that the, the, the people might want to hear on that on record. Um, but yeah, I think asking him questions about the Kyle Pred incident, we have two PD witnesses already, Bundy and no, Mountain. Harvey, too. Um, and I think we got a statement from Axel, too. Who said what happened? <laughs> Obviously, if he admits to it, then uh, it's not exactly a good look. But then it's okay. <laughs> I, I we could do the whole having a like. <laughs> could you imagine if while we got the senator in the room? I can't remember what I'm trying to think of. There's a movie. And like while that's happening, we have like a line of like SWAT officers just ready outside the room. <clears throat> we like call him in after he's already in the room and get him all ready in case he starts going batshit crazy. Honestly, it's like bringing in, it's like bringing in fucking Batman or like the Superman into into a PD. But I don't know whether we should arrest him there and then because I think that kind of like. Uh, it's a bit of a squeeze on the story like it's there's not a lot of outcomes there whereas if we like say to him listen after that we're going to be writing a warrant for your arrest uh or i'm going to be issuing a, a you know a warrant for your arrest you can either turn yourself in here and now or you know obviously things i don't want to threaten the guy but things could get sticky and then obviously he could leave and be like, I'm the senator, just this and this. And then we can organize something else. There might be questions about, he's a government employee, though. Which is true. But we're going to die. Hello! Anybody? Fucking bastards, sir. I need to get food and then I need to go FK for a minute. Sooner rather than later. Where else is it? Ooh, maybe. Uh, but the exception to the government employee rule is if it's a violent felony, which this is. So. Bro. 
Bro, what is happening? Burger shop, please. I'm gonna die. This is a this is a cold three situation. God, I'm gonna get paneled for this. Someone needs to make like an emote of like you know, a little people emo when you get hit with a bat, but just get hit with a a sign that just says panel on it. That'll be a pretty good emote. <laughs> Hello. Please, I'm starving. <laughs> Come on. Don't see the 13 Bravo on your screen already, please. I'm not going to fuck it in the haze. Haze can suck my nuts. Haze might have food though. Um, what about roosters? Come on. There's people here. These guys running from the sirens. so hungry yeah, yeah, I'm fine I feel myself passing out there you go <sighs> no. oh my god. I'm all right I'm just lying down oh my god no I'm just gonna take a nap I'm gonna take a nap oh Thanks, Kylie. You kind of saved the day there. I'm my gold. <laughs> oh, how are you? I'm doing okay. Good. I'm waiting for Good. Manny to finish with her meeting. Oh, yeah, she's in trouble. We're in big trouble. Oh, okay. Yeah. You can, whenever she gets out, just say congratulations, out. Oh, okay. Right, she's pregnant. Wait, what? Hey, Blob. Hey, Dad, how you doing? I'm agree. Uh, I'm currently at a 37 Alpha. 
But are you good? I saw you on duty. I didn't see call 41. Yeah, Kylie saved me. Yeah, Kylie saved me. I was very hungry, but I'm all right now. Okay, good, good. Well, if you need anything, you let me know, all right? Okay, thanks, Sean. Bye-bye. Not a problem. Talk to yeah, yeah, medicine's present. Yeah, just say congratulations when you get a chance. Thanks, Kylie. Uh, who's ready for the incoming 1013 shots fired 78? Because I sure am. I'm so excited. So excited for that. Oh, God. Back to Beaver Bush for a week. Yeah. Oh yeah, I'm, I am. I will get one tapped. That's true. It happens in e every single time, every game, even dark and darker. We got one tap. <laughs> boop boop boop. I still have the the parachute from the war. Wonder if that will come in come in handy. Won't be used. What the hell, sir? That well, thank you. First of all, <laughs> it's such a good gift. <laughs> it's such a good one. All right, we're good. Should we listen in? Oh no, I'm doing. I'm doing things. All right, chat. I'm back in a sec. I'm gonna go get myself uh, another cup of coffee because I'm very tired. I'll be back in a minute and I'm gonna go watch LSBN things.
I leave the sirens on? Oops. <clears throat> I did. Alright, I got myself a cup of coffee and then I got some lunch ready in like 10 minutes. So let's watch some videos. <laughs> Claimed by Fenrir, Trojan, and Sanguine? Okay. <laughs> That's a Trojan called Ursula. All right. Don't oh, make call me. Let's have a look. An anonymous source inside the prison told Alice Bean that the police were concerned for Flynn's safety, fearing the anger held by the Sanguinians towards the medics and the suicide bomber. Flynn confirmed his status SBN, <clears throat> but that the Sanguinian prisoners had no desire to harm her. Flynn declined further comment without legal representation. Return to sender, Tro Trojan said eerily. Okay. Interesting. What was a video from an unofficial town hall that looks like Grayson held? All right. Might should have a look. This is 52 Ooh. minutes. How I don't know whether we can watch that. Oh, wait, this is a sea hall. Oh, cool. Not sea hall, but like the old sea hall. Um. Ooh, Grayson talking about LS Constitution, San Andreas Constitution. Aegis was overstepping. Um, didn't these guys kill the commissioner in jail? Lang butter after Grayson's speech. Chief Justice Crane, throwing subtle shade at Grayson, told everyone to educate themselves on the invasion and do their own research. Trying to compress the last three weeks to a month into a five-minute speech is both foolish and unproductive. Uh, Titus Swinghammer agreed with Grayson on the issue of removing due process being wrong. He also spoke with two people who went to prison unjustly because of sanguine but were not involved. Shelly Smith took the stage. Sam Bass. <sighs> Former Mayor Langwood called for the use of Sanguine Isle as a place to put people with stupid names. <laughs> oh my god, Percy Weaver called for a vote of no confidence against Alan Crane as well as the Senate, citing that the laws that go into place don't go through judges. There was a great deal of disagreement in the audience to that notion. I don't know whether he should have gone against Crane. He should have said it against the Senate, sure. The Chief Justice position should be a voted in position by all of the judges. I mean, I mean, yeah, that sounds kind of good. Uh, Judge Carlson agreed with her colleagues wanting to take back the state for ourselves. Elizabeth Gates spoke against the lack of due process as her son is in prison for treason. Right. <clears throat> Interesting. Uh, Indicated a slippery slope to losing freedoms. Esteemed veteran Holden Maddox said before the crowd, release them and give Oswald the death penalty. <laughs> 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 Former Deputy Mayor Eve Summers was passionate when she got on stage, referencing Judge Gates' speech. You talk about due process when they're little terrorists and treasonous. Miss Summers went on to speak to Judge Gates' bias as her son is involved. We are not going to be bombed again. I mean, uh, and then yeah, the PBSO bombing. Yeah, what, what about that? Carmine Casella questioned why the Sanguinians were brought to San Andreas to be fed our good food before shouting death to Cerberus. He also announced he was running for Senate. What the fuck? Okay, so we've got Carmine and Brian Knight running for Senate. With but <clears throat> Mayor Andy Jones arrived to offer a rebuttal on many points. First, criticizing anyone who thinks Crane should be replaced due to the amount of work he does. Let's who spoke to the sanguine arm situation, reminding everyone that they were warned for many days, multiple times, of the consequences. The mayor was amenable towards dissolving the Senate. Oh, 
and invited the public to reach out with ideas on how to go about that. Pog? Judge Grayson spoke uh, towards Mayor Jones' statement about warning the Sanguinians. You cannot usurp the Constitution because you throw up a state announcement. True. True. I think Andy was more talking about people who are getting treason, not necessarily the due process part. Chief of EMS Keith Pendrang was surprised the DOJ wants to hold trials for the dozens of Sanguinar participants as they didn't want to be citizens of Los Santos anymore. Judge Grayson said she had a point, but mentioned that people from Sanguine were sovereign citizens of another nation. They were not actively beholden to our laws while on the Isle of Sanguine. True. Tony, Cor Tony Corleone going to speak on police inaction against bystanders being hit by cars by racers. He demanded to have the chief of police look into this matter. Huh? Avid racer spoke against racers hitting civilians? I mean, okay. Uh, Raymond Romanov spoke to corruption in the system. Lang Border called him out for his gang's actions leading to the Rust Act. Okay, yeah. As the one who calls this unofficial town hall, Judge Grayson thanked everyone for the attendance. Yeah, okay. Honestly, it sounded like it was pretty good. Good RP. Okay, I got this. NSPM was sent a video by two mass individuals claiming to have bombed the Polito Bay Sheriff's Office last week. Oops. <clears throat> Let's have a look then. It's only three minutes. People in Los Santos, money. Jesus Christ. People of Los Santos, my name is Fenrir. And you see myself alongside Trojan Horse and, and in the memory of Jaeger Demon Blonde, we bombed Polito PD. And you see, I like to remind the great state of San Andreas that the thing about betrayal is it doesn't come from your enemies. That's something that I live by, that's something that my people live by. You see this reign of terror? It isn't going to end, even if one of us is locked up, two of us are locked up, three of us are locked up. Hell, you could lock up the whole nation of Sanguine like you have, and it won't stop the great tyranny that is going to come upon y'all. You kill one, and two replace them. You kill those two, four replace them. It is never ending. I can't take sanguine. this. I'm sorry, I can't take this seriously, dude. I just can't. How can we have terrorists with a with this mask on? Come on. My name is Trojan. I am one of the bombers that bomb Polito, and I am one of the bombers that are not going to stop until the message is clearly delivered and read. You ever wondered why the war really started? Why the PD decided to invade Sanguine? Ask yourself, have you seen any evidence of any smuggling, of any trafficking? No. The PD, Brian Knight, who is no longer a cop, has Rest stated that they do have evidence. Yet, we are still yet to see it. Okay. Why does he sound like someone has made an AI? And what they did was they just went and interviewed the old British man that sits in the corner of a pub that is, like, drunk on three pints. That's all, that's all I can hear. Here's the thing about war. <laughs> war has come to an end. 
every time there's a war, there is always one winner. This isn't a war. There is no end. Sanguine will thrive. Sanguine will live on. And the bombings won't stop until certain people are either six feet on the ground or Well, I guess you're just gonna have to find out. What the? That's not an ultimatum. That's a. What the hell? It's a puzzle. What do we have to do? Well, I guess you're just gonna have to find out. <laughs> certain people. Who is. Who is the certain people? Brian's not a cop. Axel's dead. Who's it? The senator? Oh damn it. Alright, I'm gonna go grab my food chat. Um so in the meantime, I am gonna grab I'm gonna watch the the thing above. We'll watch the town hall while I uh while I eat some food really quick. Cause I am interested to see how it went. Cause we, we don't wanna read just the snippets. I am um, how is everybody? I'm ten seven. I am ten seven I'm ten seven. I'm literally. I can't do anything. I gotta go grab my food. <laughs> anyway. Doing today. Hey, nice to see you. I see you too. Nice to see everybody Hi, here. Hi, so, over the past couple of weeks, I've received a multiple requests from the public, from individuals, from corporations, from members of the PD who have stated that they wanted a voice, that they wanted to be heard, that they wanted their opinions to at least be listened to in a public setting, right? A lot of discussions are going on interdepartmentally, departmentally, behind the scenes, where everyone's discussing things, but no one's just throwing this open to the public to see what your opinions of the last few weeks have been. And I think that's important. I think in an active functioning democracy, that is what happens. Now, I have some remarks before I throw this open to the floor. I'm going to 